We're at the historic Columbia River Highway Lateral Falls Bridge structure. This structure was built in 1914 and is 310 feet long. In September, we discovered a sinkhole developing in the corner of the bridge right here. Uh, we did an emergency fill repair. The sinkhole was caused by road surface water coming down the road and pulling at this end of the bridge and finding a way to escape. There were no catch basins at this location and the water just permeated through the ground, slowly eroding the subsurface materials. The first item we addressed was the soft loamy soil that was used at the embutment. The crews had to dig down and locate the exact edge of a lower concrete spreader beam and be able to drive sheet pile next to it. The spreader beam started five feet down and continued for another three feet. So the crew used guardrail as sheet pile and overlapped it to make an impregnable wall to keep the soil and earth from moving under the structure and causing a new sinkhole. The guardrail sections were 12 feet 6 inches long and we went from one side of the bridge to the other which was about a 26 foot span. After the sheet pile was driven to deal with any subterranean moisture that may come in, river rock was placed and inside that a perforated pipe wrapped in a bio blanket to remove any excess water from the embutment of the bridge. So then we filled that trench on top of the river rock with three quarter minus to build a solid road base and work that all the way up to the surface. We came out from the original pipe about five feet and dug a second trench to install catch basins and drains. That entailed digging down another five foot deep trench, installing box catch basins to deal with all the road surface water that came to this location and cause the original sinkhole. Now we have two new catch basin drains to handle all the road surface water and run off to the side of the road. Once the second pipe and drains were installed, we also covered that with three quarter minus rock and compacted it to be a good road surface. And once that was completed, we repaved the area of both trenches. And the end result is a quality finished product that will take all the road water and remove it from this area, alleviating any future sinkholes that may develop and protect this historic structure from future generations.